As a fashion student, the garment district is a place where I can find inspiration. Endless selections of materials, numerous colors, patterns, and types of fabrics. Little details can make a huge difference to a whole design. Buttons, ribbons, you name it. Choose your material and there's nothing stopping you from creating your vision. However, the district isn't what it used to be. Who are your loyal customers? Designers. How have the customers changed over the years? We used to have more. High rent has led to many of the factories, shops, to close down. Cheaper labor abroad has led to manufacturers using other countries instead of the factories in the garment district. 95% of clothes sold in the US before the 1960s were made in the single square mile of Manhattan. Today, only 3%. There were so many factories here, now many are closed. What happened? It started with retailers wanting more and more inexpensive products, not less quality, but inexpensive products that could be produced elsewhere. Founded by the Garment District's 575 property owners and over 6,500 businesses, there have been slight improvements. The Garment District Alliance was formed to improve the quality of life and economic vitality of Manhattan's Garment District. Do you think customers notice the effects? Our customers complain that there are no stores anymore. The selection isn't what it used to be. My artifact for this project is a garment that expresses the old and the new. The checked older material is what the Garment District used to be for the factories and shops living up to its name. The bottom represents the new garment district with a blue jean-like material showing us how the modern apartments and district isn't what it used to be and continues to be taken over.